Mark you more in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Words. Now here I am, and you're looking at me, and you can see my face. But as I talk, you are listening. Words. Words are powerful. I had a funny story. I didn't know this is true or not, but I want to believe this is true. That is, there was a lady that would go to one of a room where they have plants uh, that um, um, are green and flowery and, you know, very nice plants. And she would talk to certain plants. Oh, you're a wonderful plant. You can have beautiful flowers and and. Uh, put water and, and, and things like that. And then on the other side, there were some plants and she would say nothing, just pour some water. Months go by. It says the plants that she was talking to, I love you, you are great, and touch the leaves and, and would say words to that plant. It says they blossomed. They grew and greener, but the other one just withering away. Well, the truth of the matter is, Bible says very clearly, life and death are in the power of your tongue. Words you say. Don't say to your children, you're dumb, you're useless. Don't say to your wife, you're no good. Don't talk evil about other people. Talk to people good things about them, encourage them. Say verses from the scripture that will build them up. Stop saying negative things. Words either kill people or give them life. You know it. Blessings on you.